Hello, my friends. Welcome to another episode of Life with Stephanie, where I share the crazy, wild, weird, awkward things that happen in my life. Um, if you're a true fan, you watch these episodes. If you're not so much of a true fan, eh, click to the next video. <laughs> okay, so every year, my mother does a Christmas card picture. So we all have to dress up and we, we get everybody in the car and we go to my mom's house and we take a, a Christmas photo. And it's, it's never anything fancy. It's not like a professional photo or anything. Somebody just snaps the camera and we all smile and we get our picture, right? Well, sorry. So last year she told everybody you must wear red or green. Okay, the problem is, is Stephanie does not have red or green. You know me. Typically, I'm wearing a black t-shirt, not always with the stamps of life on my chest, but usually I'm just wearing a black t-shirt. Sometimes I throw it and mix it up a little bit and do a brown t-shirt. Every once in a while, well, of course, when I go to Sizzix, every Tuesday I go to Sizzix and work there, um, I dress up. I wear like necklaces and I like, I wear cute boots and I look cute on those days. But when I'm just going to our office, I mean, it's a warehouse, it's dirty. I mean, I just wear t-shirts and, and flip-flops, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm more casual than you think. And so I'm like, no red and green. So I wore this green, I wish I had it to show it to you. It was just like this green pullover sweater, but it was more aqua than green. And for a whole year, I had to listen to my mom complain that her Christmas card was ruined because I wasn't wearing the wrong color. Now she was just kidding, but I mean, you know what I mean, okay. So fast forward to this year, this year again, you must wear red or green. So I panic. Now, of course, I didn't run to the store the second she told me. I waited until about an hour before we were gonna take the photo. So I went to um, Nordstrom Rack, not Nordstrom, because I can't afford Nordstrom, but I went to Nordstrom Rack, because you know they have cheaper stuff there, but it's still really nice stuff, and you can find some really good deals there, especially on clearance. And so we're, Ken ran in with me, we went after church, Ken and I just ran in there, and I'm like, grab anything that's red in my size, I wanna look at it. So he's looking through stuff, and, and he found this really cute sweater that was like a pullover thing, but it was really cute, but it was a little off on color. So I was hoping maybe, it was like more of a burgundy, so I was hoping I could find something else. And so I found this other shirt, and then I found another shirt, I found this shirt. And I'll show it to you in a minute. And so I was like, oh gosh, so I, I got this shirt, and so it's pretty much red. I hope it shows up red on the video. And it's cute. I mean, I was trying to find something that I might wear again. I don't wear red very often. I'm not a red girl. See, I'm not a red girl. I'm just not. Black. Uh, I, I, I'm boring. And so I, I got this and I thought it was cute and it was $26. And I'm like, ooh, that's a lot of money for something you're only gonna wear a couple times. But I figured, oh, maybe I'll wear it to a Christmas party or something with some nice slack. So, okay, fine. So. I was looking though at this sweater Ken was holding, you know, the one that went like this. And I was like, oh, Kenny, I really kind of still like that one. And it was a prettier color. It was, it was a color I probably wear again. And so I was thinking, I said, ooh, Kenny, how much is it? Maybe I'll still get it, you know, how much is it? And so he goes, I don't know, I didn't look at the price. I just, I thought it looked nice, so I grabbed it. So it was on clearance. I go, oh, honey, good, it's on clearance. So I grabbed the tag and I pulled it up and I looked at it and I know I'm getting older, but I looked at it again. It was $109 on clearance. And I went, Kenny, you have good taste. And I said, now, as much as I like the sweater, I am not buying the sweater for $109 on clearance. I'm sorry, that is like utterly, forgive me, I think it's disgusting. So I'm like, I am not buying this sweater. And I said, but sweetheart, I appreciate the thought and I appreciate that you have very good taste. <laughs> you have very good taste in clothing, 109 sweater on clearance. And now I did not look at the original price because I probably would have fallen over dead. <laughs> So instead, I wore this cute little shirt, cheese, and um, we got to my mom's house and my dad's house, and um, my daughters were not wearing red and green, and yes, they had time to go get something. They don't work as many hours as I work, and they had time to, plenty of time to go get something. They did not, and I come in with my little red shirt on. Ken was wearing, I don't remember, I don't even remember. We'll show you the picture at the end of this video. Um, Ken was wearing, I don't know what else he was wearing. The baby, my cousin, my nephew Ben looked adorable as always. And of course my sister-in-law, oh, she's the stunner of the family. She's, she's you'll see in the picture, she's gorgeous. She looks like Eva Longoria, she's stunning. Then there's my brother, my dad, my mom, whatever. So I'm wearing my red. Most of them, Brandon's, my brother's family's wearing his red. And um, my daughter's, my mom looks at me, sees that I'm wearing red, she goes, she looks at my daughter, she goes, oh, it's okay. You just wear whatever you want. Let's go take the picture. 
So hmm, that's my life. <laughs> Ah, yes, that's my life. So at least my kids, because I thought my kids were going to get yelled at and I was waiting for them to get yelled at and they didn't. And I was kind of mad about that. Um, sometimes I think I'm more their sister than I'm their mom. And I think my mom is everyone's mom, but whatever. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me for another Life with Stephanie video. If you're still hanging here and you haven't clicked away. <laughs> And I will show you the picture at the end of the video so you can stay tuned. You'll see my mom, you'll see my dad, you'll see my younger brother, you'll see his beautiful wife, Marcella, you'll see my nephew, Ben, the light of my life, you'll see Ken, and you'll see my two wonderful daughters, Kirsten and Katie. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.